Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am your host, the brony that they do call Ghost, coming back to you now with a game of League of Legends. Today, we have a good friend of mine playing support. We have Shadow Evelyn, Misfortune, uh, Unconnected, Morgana, a Gwyn, Sona, Hecarin, Zombie Brad, Singed, Corky, and Jax. So we have a great combination today. Um, how is everybody? Hopefully you're having a great Wednesday. And hopefully we'll have, uh, enjoy our double uh, something new Wednesday. Uh, hopefully that you guys saw the other video. And hopefully you guys will like, subscribe, and enjoy it. As we wait for the loading screen, as we can see, we have Gaia Sushi, Paper Tempora, Crickem Nigfop, Kerr, Intro 94, Maka Twist, Lost Echoes, End, Ender Fire, and IR Sapin. Everyone with actually, everyone except for Singed, actually having nice ping today, which is surprising since every game that I've played so far always has just terrible, terrible ping, 2, 300. And it's just like, why can't I get the nice ping? Well, crappy internet, ladies and gentlemen. And so, hopefully it will load as I take deep breaths and hope for nothing to happen. So, from the top, it looks like we have two silvers and three normals. Yep, there we go. Alright. So, to start off, we have uh, my my uh, team internet in the bottom blue with the outside world as team purple. Both sides looking like we're going to go just straight. Let's see. Going to have Zombie Bride going AP, or mid, as tower. Or mid next to tower, singe top, naturally. Uh, looks like Hecarim's gonna go jungle. Might be yes, uh, well, let's see, who else do we have? Yeah, it's Corky and Sona are gonna go bottom with against, let's see, let's see, let's see. Morgana's gonna go mid, TF, or MF, I should say, is gonna go bot, and then we're gonna have... Maybe? Maybe, maybe? I don't know. Looks like we're just gonna have uh, blue defense for the first 30 seconds. 30 seconds, there you go. We have Hecarim and the Corky just guarding the ramp, not really doing much. Sona just, you know, being support. And the... Oh, well, it's <laughs> basically identical here. It doesn't look like anything of anything's really gonna happen, though they only have the one Jax here who can't really stop if they were gonna invade the blue, but... No. <laughs> Nobody's gonna go for the blue. The uh, Evelyn <laughs> just Minions giggling it up next to the wolves who haven't even summoned. <laughs> the MF Tarek dancing it out. The Corky Hecarim. Hecarim's gonna be the jungle. There we go. With the Corky just being support jungle. <laughs> and the Brad also being support jungle. Hecarim getting them kills right away. Singe running back to top. Just get ready with uh nobody really gonna looks like it looks like uh the evelyn and jackson are actually gonna take care of the blue just to help morgana get that early mana or just leave it to evelyn who's gonna take this for her i would think morgana would take it for the mana since then she could spam against the brad but i guess they don't want it the Tarek and mf now going straight into bot lane sona and corky now knowing well, they can't really get to that bush. Up oh, there's this. There it goes. So no big deal now. Top lane looks like we just have the melees just kind of dancing around each other, trying to get at the minions, and the sin is just kind of paying a little bit for there for the that 115 gold. Morgana and Brand just chilling. Really, I mean, it's just an AP dance right now. Nothing really big since this is early game. Sona just popping wards like it's nobody's business. Tarek doing the exact same with the Corky. Just kind of pounding away. MF poking a little. Sona doing the exact same. He doesn't want any of that. Hecarim taking the stoned brothers at the top. Jax just dancing around with the minions. The Evelyn now taking red. So she does have purple buff. Bluff. Bluff. Buff, 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 buff. Purple buff. Now going also for the stoned gentleman. And it looks like this Corky is going full attack. But the Evelyn might come in here for an early first blood. But we do see... That ward and the Sonas. Oh, gonna go for the, gonna go for it. Tarek might get the kill here. There we go. The steal by the MF. That Sona having to flash to get out of there so she wouldn't die. 
Do we see any returns for it? No, no one really tried for it. The Singed couldn't do much. The Brad just poking a little with the Zambi. But not really doing much. Evelyn, great assassination. Knowing that, knowing that the ward was there, she did just go straight invisible right here and then just kind of walked right in. No big deal. Hecarim now going for a return here. Jax might be cut out of this one if he can't do anything here. But Jax just dances around. Everybody uses the flash and gets out of there. The Hecarim with the four legs, you think he'd be fast, but he is only a spirit horse. Moving on now, we have the Morgana and the Evelyn trying to get rid of the Sins just to get that mid lane attack, but this brand is just so mean with his 37 attack. No, actually, it's his base damage, so 64. Evelyn, here we go, round two. Can she get this? There's the stun. Brad is aware that there's a gank. He's gonna have to use the flash. Can they get him with it? Oh, 6 HP! Gets away with it. Lucky, lucky Brad. Evelyn happy that she got a very successful that might not have been as successful, but now that they've pushed the brat out of that Morgana is gonna get some wonderful extra freed if the Hecarim just kind of bugs off. The Morgana can land another stunt. Oh, didn't get it, but if Morgana could have landed another stun there, that would have been a great pickup for Team Internet. And the Hec it's interesting that the uh, Evelyn isn't trying to go for the other team's jungle now that they know the Hecarim's right there. There goes the stun, I forgot what I just said. They might just Nope. There's another flash. That's two flash. But the MF picks up another Corky. Another one. So we're going to see MF starting to snowball in that bottom lane. Just really now out laning. <sighs> Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. Just get into a nice, nice position. All right. The MF now just really out laning the Corky. Because, well, that's two kills. Both picked up by her. Given to her by the Corky. And we can see 23 to only nine. So it's a big gap compared to what the MF has. Evelyn now in mid lane, just kind of dancing around the Brad, just trying to do something, even though she is jungle, the Morgana's really there. There isn't even close right now, just that Evelyn's just trying to kind of survive in mid against an AP Brad. As we can see in bot lane, Corky has returns to the terrible lane of bot, which MF is now probably in great control since the Corky is only level two against a level five MF with a support Sona who's four and a support Tarek who's also 4. Brad who's still level 5 being pretty chill against the Morgana who so far has scared the pants off of the Brad even though he's almost, almost dead. Uh, Hecarim now just picking up some wraiths and Jax who is missing his singed. Oh singed, oh singed, where art thou my singed? Singed just like I'm coming to Jax, I'm a coming! Hello turret, turret just doesn't care. And we're going to see the Hecarim might just pick up some stone gentlemen. And the Evelyn... What is the Evelyn doing? Just being invisible. Alvin. See this Corky, very aggressive for something that's only two levels below them. For something two levels below the MF. Sorry about that. And it's just interesting because that was a really bad move because now they can't really sustain this push and now this MF is just getting this free feed and when that minion dies no one's here to pick up that XP that's a really bad see there's two two waves right there just picked up by MF and really they can't do much to stop this thing Evelyn though very out of position for the Widowmaker and looks like Hecarim's just gonna give this blue to Brad if Evelyn doesn't steal it here Evelyn might be going for it because she wants it. There, she's there. The Sona's there. There's the, there's the smite, ladies and gentlemen. We do have the first steal of this game. Everyone's like, oh dang, team fight going down, but too late. That blue is already gone, and it is in a Widowmaker's hands. Jax up top. Brad, or Brad Singed now coming down. They have the same color, you know. One's blue and one's oh, both are green. What are we talking about? Hmm. <clears throat> The Widowmaker coming up, up. She's gonna be seen by the. Yep, there's the pinks. They know. They know very much so. That's right. This Evelyn's just gonna give this blue to Morgana, I would believe. Tarek and MF are very unaware that there is a Hecarim there. The Hecarim's just gonna come down. Might be able to pick up the Tarek, but. Wow! That burst! That is a. Do nothing. Brad's coming down here now. He wants some of this. He wants some of this. He's just like, I am coming down. 
Nope. I was thinking maybe the MF could run around and dive for him, but it looks like he didn't want to. And the Corky's just gonna be the sin. It's very low. I saw it on the sidebar, and that is a gank. That was... Oh! 9 HP! <laughs> very, very lucky Evelyn on that one. That was a great save by that player. Looks like everyone's just kind of getting back into lanes, resetting. Everyone's taking a breather now. That was a great fight. 3-0 for Team Internet. And it looks like the Jax is just kicking away. Why am I still focused on... I don't really care about Sin. She died. It looks like top lane is just... Gonna... Well, top lane is gonna win this... Gonna win this again. 8 versus 7. So there's obvious gap there. 5-4 uh, against 6-7. Obvious gap there. Uh, seven on seven, so no, let's tie there. The Hector might be going for the Jax, and the, yeah, this is going to be a quick cleanup, but this Jax doesn't do anything. Jax is going to go down for the three person, but Morgana teleported, interestingly enough, to possibly try and save him, but, well, it's obvious that the battle's already lost. I don't, it's interesting that, did, does MF have, or MF, MF, what am I talking about? Morgana have, uh, teleport, teleport, how do I press, but, and what happened? Hmm. Didn't mean to do that. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to see an instant replay of as the Jax tries to get away. So it is a teleport by my Morgana. My Morgana. My Morgana, Morgana, where art thou? My Morgana. Um, so she does have the teleports on her. Yeah, that's gold. Not what I'm looking for here. But, oh well. Playing around with the camera. Whoopee. So she does have the teleport on her, which I probably should have remembered from the uh, loading screen. And, well, tried to do something there, but as you can see, Hecarim, who did get that kill for them? Uh, it was the brand. The Brad. So, that's going to be very good for the mid lane since, well, now it's... Does Morgana have a kill on her? No, she's still 0-0, but that Brad will have the extra kill, so... It's gonna, let's see, it's 51 on 46, so it's gonna help Brad catch up in, for that gap, but Brad looks like he might be coming down, it looks like he's greedy, he wants another one, he wants another kill, he wants a dead, he wants a dead bot lane, but Tarek and MF are already out of there, they know, they know, Brad's just chilling that bush, he, he wants some, but well, when you're that dead, I mean... Morgana now checking out the Hecarin. Hecarin's just like, up, 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 nobody cares. Oh, great stun by the Morgana. Just gonna start smacking away at the Hecarin. Hecarin's gonna, uh, he's gonna push in a little bit, but he doesn't really care. Uh, he's pretty, he pretty heavy on attack damage, but is he good on man magic resist? He's only got 53 against, Morgana's 92, so he's, uh, he's a little bit of magic resist. Corky though, bot, oh, there's a dead MF. The Corky gets taken down, the Brad takes down the MF, and it looks like Brad's gonna keep going, he wants to die, that's a double kill for the Tarek, Tarek is dead, the Evelyn's getting out of there, the Corky's, Corky, great, great attack by Brad and Corky, great, 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 great. Looks like that's gonna be it. The Evelyn's just gonna try and defend it, but Brad and Corky are just gonna harass her out of it. They might get another one. There is a, there is three, there is two. That is a shutdown. Great, great. That was a pretty good move for the Evelyn there since she did die, but she did pick up the 432 gold just for having the turret do the job for her. Corky now back up to seven on MF7, so... While he was down very early game, he did come back very quickly from this giant gap in bot lane that was uh, the g from the two kill early game. Singed and Jax, well, Singed doesn't care. Jax is just taking some more free minions, which is a really bad idea for him since, well, he's just smack, smack, smacking away. Hecarim and Morgana in mid lane, which is interesting because jungle is supposed to be in jungle and. Well, mid lane is where it's supposed to be, but uh, here comes the Brad to take care of the mid lane. Hecarim can get back to his job. Ooh, careful there, Sona. You're gonna get attacked. Uh oh, looks like another fight for blue. This might be this might be something here. That golem, he's set. He's ready to die. He's ready for a team fight. 
These these little ur, ur, these little street urchins, well, aren't gonna do much, but they'll do something. Hector, I'm just getting ready. He's like, all right, it's going down. He needs all the health he can get, but really, oh yeah. This is definitely a fight for blue. Here it goes. We have the Hecarim starting it. He's just trying to kill that thing. Everyone's very aware of it. They want it. Oh, but that was a stun. Or that was a smite by the Hecarim to steal it. And everyone kind of goes back to their job. Oh, oh, oh. Jax is going to get something here. He might pick up the Singe. Singe is just... Nope, never follow a Singe trail. Because that little stuff will kill you. I'll start dancing around that. Actually, uh, no, he couldn't. I was thinking he could dive into the turret, kill the singe, and then just kill the turret right off the right off the back of it, but couldn't do that. So looks like the lanes have reset once again, even after that blue fight. Though it wasn't really much of a fight; it was more of just a scare. And Barky and Son are just taking a bit of damage here. The MF and Tarek doing an excellent job at supporting each other. Morgana in the jungle probably took the blue, I think. Let's see where is she, where is she? Yeah, she took the blue. Corky, a bit of trouble here. He's gonna keep fighting. That's a really bad move, Corky. Whoa, that was lucky, lucky Corky. 60, 131 HP. Oh, uh, uh, what's going on? Uh, they're aware that there is a Brad coming this way. So they know. There is a zombie there, and they're very aware about that. Great team fight up top, though. I just come in as I see a dead Jax. Now the Evelyn's got to get out of there before the Hecarim and the Singe take him out. Bad idea to fight under there, and the Hecarim's just going to walk right out of there with a happy Singe. I think he was the one. Yeah, Singe got the kill with the Hecarim support on that one. Morgana looks like she wants some of this undead sucker. But she's going to come out a little late there, and she's not going to find anybody. Hecarim's just gonna, yep, Hecarim's just gonna get out of there, Morgana's just face checking the bushes, Singed gonna be, and in bot lane it looks like there is nothing, 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 nothing. Oh, 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 oh. Looks like in bot lane though, they're gonna go for this turret again, they want the rest of this, they want this turret dead, they have not paid for their bills on this turret and the mortgage, they're just gonna have to evict this turret. Is that a pig? It is a pig. This one pig? Wait, what? Why is why are all the bot are all the blue turrets pigs? Wow, it tells you, ladies and gentlemen, how much I pay attention to the turrets. Cause that's a boar or a pig thing. Ah, wow, purple turrets actually look kind of cool, man. What the heck? Never noticed the blue. All right, so back to the actual commentary. Looks like we're gonna catch the Evelyn out of here completely out of. Bam. Bam. That's all you need to know, guys. Bam. That burst. They got this ward here just chilling with a little bit more support. The Tarek has got to get out of there. The stun's going to miss, and the Tarek's going to get ulted. That's a dead Tarek. Oh, the MF is gonna also going to get stunned. And there's the burst, and there's the diving hacker. That's a dead Morgana. No, wait. That was MF. There's the soul life stealing. Morgana is going to do nothing for any of these people. That was a great team fight for Team Purple. That was 5-10 picking up. Well, at least, yeah, three of the five. Jax coming back, though, to kill that Corky in revenge. He had to avenge his buddies. Actually, that was Sona. It looks like the skin. I can't tell why. But that Jax had to cause some revenge. He knew it was going down. The Singed, uh... Interestingly enough, just killing the minions here. Not really going for the turret. Ah, there we go. He was dancing around him for a little bit. Interesting. I was confused as to why he, he might be doing that. And he's not even going to smack the turret for the extra gold. Nope. Revenge by minions. Baron's just chilling there, being a giant ugly sucker. Thank you, Baron. And the ward there, interestingly enough. I guess they were afraid of a rush. Singed and Jax. Jax, now he wants revenge. He knows that this is going down. He's just like, forget it. I want you dead. He's going to come all the way up here. The Evelyn, as you can see on the minimap, is going to come up here and try and go for a chase. But it looks like we're going to see a dragon push, maybe by Team Purple. But at top, as you can see, the Evelyn... What's she doing? She's going to... Wow, she's going to go for the dive. She wants the sin. Oh, nope, there's the flip. Bad move by Sin. She's going to escape right into the Evelyn. The Jax 
Might pick him up. He might get the kill here. He wanted that revenge. He's like, it's time to die. Sucker. Oh, the flip, the spin, the whoop, the trips. What the heck? Holy cow. I totally missed this fight. Perp double. They pick up dragon. A lot of dead. Mostly all dead. Brad and Hecarim going for this poor Morgana. There's the dive. There's the Hecarim taking it. And there's the ace. I hate how I keep focusing on the smaller <laughs> little Jack's revenge and then the Brad and then the dragon and the skiddly bop in the beat boops. So we're seeing a great comeback by Team Purple here. Originally it seemed like it was just going to be a complete landslide by uh, Team Internet and it would just be a quick fight but right now, right there ladies and gentlemen you can hear it 2 to 1 on turrets, 23.8k to 26.6k. And it is going to be a quite, it's going to be quite a long of a fight. Great little minion ball there. Looks like the Sona is going to pick up this. And she's just going to buzz it a little. Not really trying, but she wants the minions. And everyone's like, ooh, we got to get that. We're going to have to get the blue quick before someone else does. And ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, these guys are just everywhere. Everyone's starting to reset, but it looks like where the Corky and the Sona are still going to go for the bot. The Evelyn and the Tarek also going so they know. They know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Totally screwed that up. They know very much so that the Sona and Corky are now down here by themselves. The... Jax <laughs> going for that revenge. He wants another bit of singed. He wants his he wants his pipe. I mean he wants that giant bottle, man. Yeah, so you see the ping going off. They're like, alright, it's time to kill the sucker. And it might be another blue fight, actually. <laughs> Looks like it might just be the Sona and the Singe. They know they know it's spell immune. Hecarim, he's gonna go for that speed. The Singe also going for the speed. There's the ult going straight for that Morgana. Just diving through the tower, doesn't care. Sin very aware. That might be another dead Morgana. I mean, there's. Yep. There it goes. In bot lane, though, we see another. There's a switch once again. The Evelyn ganking down here, probably killing. There's Brand. Brand somewhere, dead. Jax wants some. Yep, there he goes. Once again, he's gonna go for that Hecarim coming back down here to pick up. What might be just another kill if this turret doesn't finally poke him to death? Jack's just spinning around here, letting the turret do ha most of his work. He's just got a little bit of blood, blood clock going on in his heart, and it's hurting him. But this MF and the Sona are just going to go straight for each other. The Sona just wants a bit of him. Jack's now going for the splitting blade. He's going to smack that Singe to death with this lamppost if he can try as hard as he can. The Evelyn now coming down. Singe just got to get out of there. He's going to poison chase them all the way home. But this Evelyn is just poke, poke, poking away, and this Hecarim, here comes Hecarim, here comes Hecarim, beating the shit out of Jax, and that is gonna be, might just be another dead singe, there's the poison, that is a dead singe for a dead Jax, and it's gonna be 12 to 18 against Team Internet, and it's gonna be a very hard to come back, though they're only down just a little over 2k gold. Still bad news as what might just be the third tower goes. This MF and the Sona just fighting valiantly. This MF gonna get caught out. Lots of burst damage down. The support now just trying to do something. Alt on the support. Dead Brad. This might be a saving grace for Team Internet. But this oh, Morgan Golden Morgana. Nothing's gonna happen. That is gonna be a dead Corky. 14 to 19. Ladies and gentlemen, Team Internet is coming back. There's the dubs. Evelyn, I think, dived. Yeah, she dived for the Sona and got the Sona kill. That is a dead mute right there, ladies and gentlemen. Hecarim, though, he's he might just stop that double and give... Nope, Jax, Jax is just getting out of there. It might be a two-level difference, but these guys are professionals to some degree. As he ults in, picks up the Evelyn. Now that the Singe is here, they're going to dive straight for that Jax. Hecarim doesn't really kill that. He's slowly getting poked to death. The stun by the Tarek. Another attack. There's the heal from the Jax. The Jax going straight for the Hecarim. The Hecarim now wants the Tarek. The Tarek running away like a bitch. The Morgana is now going for the Hecarim. The Hecarim's just getting away. What are you guys doing? 
He's got 159 HP, and this Brad is gonna come back, protect him. Hecarim's gonna be, he's forced, but there's a double kill by the Morgana, the Tarek's still alive from this fight. Oh, the ult by the Corky just trying to come in here, guns blazing as Calvary, the TF picking up this, that ult, the Singe going straight for the, yep, it's going straight for the TF, or the MF, and the MF and Tarek just trying to get out of here as they went mid lane fight. And this fight is just going on and on, ladies and gentlemen. This fight, Jesus. Akram now going top. It looks like they're just, yep, they're just going to pull out of there, ladies and gentlemen. The Evelyn's getting out of there. MF is just trying. She's just trying, ladies and gentlemen. But this, this Sona is getting out of there. Goodness gracious. Whoa! That was a fight. So as we saw in that, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot just went down and, I mean, even they were summoning and running straight down, that was how long it is. I mean, we had people dead who came back to join this fight and then to die once again. Ladies and gentlemen, looks like we don't have, oh, the Hecarim. Hecarim today will be MVP if he doesn't die in this game. I'm looking to pick up something here in this Hecarim right now is 5-0 and 7, so so far a perfect game for him. Congrats to you, Ender Fire. Good job. The Twisted Fate is now just going to kind of poison everyone to death and cry a little as the Sight Ward of all true seeing now dies. Wah, wah, wah. Light of Sight on Dragon, though. This might just cause another team fight. They really want this. The Taric doesn't want to fight, though. But the spamming is going down excessively. For both teams, they want this dragon. This dragon might just cause another team fight, though. A lot of minions and bot, and a few in top. So here we go. The Hecarim starting this. He's just gonna try and get some of this dragon. Dragon going already halfway, but it doesn't. They might be able to. Oh, they caught the Corky with the stun, but it doesn't look like it's gonna. The MF picks up the dragon from her all Excellent move by the MF. And as you can see in the top of my screen, there is just. Picking up the kills now, forcing that fight, and it looks like Team Purple just wasn't ready for it. The stun is now coming down. Singe needs to get out of there with the Revengeful Jax. And the Evelyn's just gonna go. She doesn't want it. She doesn't want that turret. Mm -mm. I mean, look at all them bars. But Jax, really revengeful. He's coming. He wants to shove that lamppost right down Singe's throat. There we go. Like I said, there's the, there's the spin. <laughs> Sage got like 86 HP, it's gotta live once again. Jax, very vengeful, he's coming, he's a coming. Sona, only one of the few that didn't die, unless she did and I didn't notice it, but Purple she might just, nope, she's on AFK. And it looks like Purple team is just gonna go, where are they pinning? They're pinging for blue, they want the blue. But it looks like the rest of the other team internet is just gonna go for their blue, and Morgana's gonna pick up this one. Jax, though, it looks like he, Jax is going to pick up their blue on the pickup of the other team's blue. As Hecarim comes down to face check the bush, see nothing of the invisible sight war, see nothing of their blue, and get out of there. Brand and uh, Singe now going... Yeah. Looks like they're going to scrunch up for another, lane, for another lane push and see what they can do. Though the Singe might just be going back into lane. I think he needs that gold. Where is he at? Let's see. Singed is at 152 against Jax's 125. So he is actually higher in CS uh, in, uh, CS than uh, Jax, interestingly enough. But doesn't look like it's going to be a whole lot to do much, sadly enough. Morgana is... That wasn't Morgana. That was... What's her face? Uh, Evelyn, of course. And, oh, oh, looks like a bear fight. Ah, smell a bear and a coming. They're going fishing. They're going fishing for Kraken. As we can see, ladies and gentlemen, they got sight. They got sight for only a little bit longer. They got the blue pool, which is bubbling blue. And everyone's going to back away from the bear. No one really, it didn't look like anyone really wanted to fight that fight, but they were just kind of pushing him off there just to make sure that they didn't. As you can see, Team Blue actually came out with a great fight. Even though they are below in kills, they have managed to pick it off with four on three for the dragon and the extra turret. So that was enough to save them up. The MF is just clear in lane with that ult. She does not want to have to deal with any of the minions, saving the turret. 
And Sona splitting the Sona there. That's actually a pretty good move. He could have pushed down there, probably, and forced the Sona to collapse in or something and stun him, but that probably would have been a bad idea. Here comes the Jax. He wants this singed, I swear it. And this Evelyn. Oh, the. Jesus, the gold, the dead, and the jacks. The good, the dead, the jacks, the dead Evelyn. Here comes the jacks. He's gonna go. Yep, he's gonna go for the Hecarim. He's gonna start smacking that Hecarim to death. Quickly going down, but it's gonna be a health fight here. Hecarim just taking care of that jacks, putting him in his place, and getting out of there as a happy, happy, as happy as a horse. <laughs> Evelyn, Jax, Evelyn, MF, and Jax. There we go. Singe doesn't want any. They're not going to force the Baron. They don't really want to, but as you can see for Team Purple, they got this Baron well aware. They know what's going on here. They know darn well. While Team Blue, uh, a little bit. They got a lot more in comparison to Purple because they know if there's a fight, they'll see most of the team. Interestingly enough, they must have cleared Voins for a second there. Pop. And as we can see, the Hecarim's just, just chilling. Another mid push, interestingly enough, by the bot team. As the Singed goes, ju Singed goes jungle, AP Hecarim, attack damage Taric, and uh, let's see what else, what else, what else. Um, also attack damn no support Brad. Good job, Hecker. Alright. Looks is Dragon ready? Is Dragon ready guys? I don't know. I don't have no counter. I have I don't have any counters. I don't have any numbers that tell me the stuff the stuff. Nah, uh, doesn't look like Dragon's gonna be ready. Dragon might be up soon. I don't know any of the counters. I'm not not there yet in the high rank in ELO. But it looks like it's going to be a push. The Hecarim Jax going straight for the Brad. The Brad is just going to get crushed. But that, who is that? The Evelyn is just in the middle of it all. Not a good spot for the Assassin. Gets taken down. But wow. Everyone but the Singe. That is gonna, not going to be a double. It's not going to be a quadra kill for everybody. That was a double kill for sure. Singe. Go, go. Go, go, Power Ranger. Singe is getting out of there. He doesn't want any of this. But this Evelyn... It's just poking and poking, and there's the flip by the singe and the zip up, bibble bop, and the Jax is not wanting any of this more. Oh, he wants some now. He sees it. He's going for it. The Jax might. Hey, spy the Evelyn. Great, 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 great move by that team. Now they're just going to push it. They might just end it, but I don't think they really have a lot to do a whole lot now that the Brad has respawned. A lot of. The Hecarim also going to be back soon. The Sona, yep, everyone's back now. So, while it was a great fight, they might might be a bad idea to fight this one. They have three low HP characters, and they're going to get forced back on this one, obviously. Everyone except for the Morgana, at least half below half health. And the Jax is <laughs> going to be greedy and take their blue. It looks like looks like Purple Team just like, all right, let's just take Baron. They know they're at half health, and Morgana can only do so much against five people. The ping's going off. Everyone's just like, come on, we need to get here. We need to get there. Hecarim realizing that they just lost blue to a Jax, who's gonna be. And no, wait, did Tarek get it? No, it was the J. Yeah, Jax did get it. Everyone just being, they're probably very aware that the Baron might be going down very quickly. Ah. No, it's a dragon. Is Sona gonna start it? Nope, Singed. Alright, good. No, Sona is gonna start it. Oh, no, okay. Quarky, interestingly enough, ulted, even though he's probably is gonna want to use that for an escape. As it gets taken down, never mind. They just want to get in and get out, and this MF is just gonna start smacking away at this team. Smack, smack, smack. No one's really doing a lot. The Hecarim ulted, interestingly enough, but there's no one really here to alt into. The Tarek though, out of position, that would have been a great move for 
the Hecarim to alt into and just kind of smack him away a little bit, but this team's getting pushed away. They don't want any of this. Sona very out of position. She's going to alt in, but she's going to go down very quickly. There goes one player. The Singe is going to start smacking some of his stuff up, but he's going down just as quickly as the Hecarim did, and that was a four-man kill. Brad only went alive, and as you can see, purple team, only one they lost was the Jax, but that was a great pickup for Team Internet. Look at all the bodies. Morgana and Evelyn now going straight for the bot. They want this turret. The Tarek and MF also want the mid lane inner turret, so they want a lot of this. Let's see, what is it? What are these? It's uh, out, outer, middle, inner? I don't know. Out, mid, in. <laughs> and this Brad is just trying and trying, and the MF is going to get poked by the tower today. Oh! Pop, 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 pop. pop. You use the flash on a heat-seeking missile. You died. This Evelyn just gonna punch you to death, I guess. Is that what she does? Does she throw like lasers or something? I don't know. What is... Now, why does Evelyn look like that blue troll thing? But she's clearly white. I mean, look at that. Look, she's. You can... You can... Oh, that's right. It's Shadow Evelyn. It's a skin. Okay. I'm okay with this. Just curious. Alright, so we can see the Tarek. Just gonna take a little bit of a B. Singed also taking a little bit of a B. As the Evelyn just runs away happily with the red. <laughs> leaving Hecarim with a little bit of gold. Laughing as the minion dies. Though it might... Oh, someone got a death cap. As you can see, the Baron... Just like, oh god! Don't look at me, I'm ugly! Blah, 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 side face thing. Ekrim picking up another stone gentleman. And... Nothing. Alright, so let's see, let's see. We got a nice little team comp in mid. Also a nice little team comp in mid, so it might look... Might, we might see another fight by Team Internet. Or Team Purple, whichever starts it, it's probably going to be on the Sona ult. The ping is going down, it looks like the fights and the withdrawals are coming in, so the orders are going to be set. Team Internet is just going to back off of this one. The Sona just slowing... <laughs> Singe does not care. He's going to sit in there and just laugh as the bullets tickle him. The bullets tickling him off of his giant Riot Shield thing, made by Riot to attack Riot characters. Riot made characters. Baron... Now, finally, might just be put out of its misery. Nope. That ugly sucker is not going to go down today. Maybe if they threw team if they throw Teemos at it. But it looks like the team fight's going to start with the Jax ulting in. The Hecarim getting the stun by the Golden. And jeez, the attacks, the shutdowns, the kills on the Corky. The Jax not getting the revenge on the Singe. The MF might just kill him. And the Singe is going to run away with only 12 health. That crazy sucker, the Sona, is going to get bursted down to death as the Jax does the burst kill. Hecarim guarding Singe's retreat as he runs away with now 40 HP. That crazy man. Hecarim, though, is now, as sadly has lost his invulnerability, is now three kills, he, three deaths. He might make this four if he doesn't back away and give up the inhibitor. Singe now back from the, with the Madrid. He's going to get stunned right there. And it's just getting poked and poked and poked and poked and poked. And the MF getting flunged over, but that's not going to do a lot. That's a dead sin. Hecarim now got to get out of there, as their only good, really, attack person is dead. The inhibitor has now been spotted, and it looks like the retreats have been given. Hecarim is going to get out of there with whatever he's got. And it looks like they're going to be like, hey guys, we need to take care of that bot lane. And that, ooh, and the top lane, the double push, is going to cause a split. It might cause a split, it might, but it's going to be a teleport, actually, by the Morgana. She wants all these minions. I mean, look at... Splat, 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 the minions die in the goos. In the ooze. The, ah! Ah, what'd I do? Oh, crap. Ah, uh, Skype. Why you do this to me? Why you do this to me? Hopefully it's still recording, ladies and gentlemen. I'm uh, kind of worried about this because it's just all tabbed. Ah, boy, oh boy, oh boy. Well, there's always one more game. Hopefully I have the time for it. No, I probably don't. Oh, well. 
if it is still recording. Sona, now, I don't know what I'll label this. Technical difficulties. Ugly Baron, no. Due to the Baron being so ugly, it broke the game, and Skype warned me about it, but then I clicked on it and it died. Yes, that makes great title. Short, sweet, to the point. All right, so as we can see, we have, yep, here comes the team fight. Here comes the team fight. Ba -da -ba 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 -da. For the bear and the ugliest monster in the game besides Teemo. As you can see, Morgana out of position. Nope, they're just, yep. The Sight Ward game is coming down as the Hecarim. Yep, yep, yep. The retreats, the attacks, the fallbacks, and the moves. It's really all going to depend on really who makes the first mistake or who makes the first attack move. And who makes the first stun? Missed it. Tarek, very out of position. He's gonna go down if they can't do anything, but there's no flash. Nobody near him. That's Tarek might be out of the game for the rest of this time. Or the out of the fight. As he has to be and run back, but it looks like he's gonna stay in with half health. Out of position, though. We're got the MF just all firing her all. Tarek's put in the stun. Dead Corky right away. Everyone's going down the sit. The Brad might just go down. Brad takes care of Tarek out. Everyone's just doubling. The Evelyn, F, the Evelyn just getting out of there. The Jax is now gonna get his sweet revenge. He might not. He gets it. That Jax has been getting his revenge all day long. Now they want that Sona. They want that Sona body. They want that support. They want that sweet support. Nope. Can't get her, but there goes the Hecarim ult. Or not the Hecarim ult, the Jack's attack, and there's the dead Hecarim. I'm sorry, buddy, it's 7 4 10. You lose my support. As <laughs> Sona tries to run away, she's trying and trying. And they're saying, look, either push the game and end it or just get Dragon, and it looks like they might just force. Well, let's see, they have the Corky now spawned. And they also have the Brad who's about to spawn. But it looks like they might be able to just attack force this one. Evelyn just being a little punk and getting out of there. They might just... They can do it. They could probably... No, they don't want to give him the triple. They don't want it with this MF. is very out of position. She's going to go down with a shutdown. And that's going to be a dead MF. And they're going to force these two out of here. They thought they could do it. But look at all the minions now just clogging up their base. And really, they got another wave here, and they got it now with a dead turret. They have another wave here that they have to deal with, and super minions now coming down with that sucker right there. This is the meanest, meanest little booger you've ever seen. Gonna go for Dragon, interestingly enough. You would think they would go for Baron, but no Baron has been wanted all game, interestingly enough. Usually, you just grab the Baron and go. But, you, I guess when you have 65.1k to 57.5k, I mean, psh, why bother? And 10 turrets to 3, plus the dragon now, that's two dragons against, against, against their only one. Everyone just taking a breather now, just trying to farm up a little bit, getting the two Gs, getting some Gs. Evelyn just taking a B, wherever she's gonna go. Nope, she doesn't want to go. Yep, she doesn't want it. She's just flipping, spinning, and kicking. And there's the respawn. They, are they going to try and... Could they possibly just... Well, no, they're not aware of it, but ladies and gentlemen... If they could... They could have run in here and just smacked up the... Inhibitor really, really quick. No, now that they're back. Would have been interesting, though. It would have been really funny if they just went... Dun, 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 Purple inhibitor... Now these minions just smack everything up. There's the shut down by the Evelyn. Or the Brad. Brad now getting taken down with the return by the uh, MF. MF is now just trying to poke away Sin Singe. Jax now, he's going for that Singe. He's like, it's mine. He's mine. But Singe, or Singe, but Jax sees much better targets as in the Sona. And there goes the Corky way out of position once again. And this MF is just ulting onto the tank, the tanker rim. And just gonna get away, trying. Just poke the turret down, guys. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. But it looks like it's... Whoa, that burst, hot dog. That's a dead singe by another MF kill. 
And it looks like Jax is just gonna smack, smack, smack me, smack this down to death. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is a GG by Force GG by Team Purple. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys have a good day, good afternoon, good night, and I'll see all of you later. And I hope you have a happier day. Goodbye.